Todd, you're the best employee I've ever had. Talented. A smart guy. Musically inclined. But I'm sorry. You're fired. But I've heard this many, many times before. And if you're watching this video, so have you. But I've got some diamond tips. Diamond tip. To help you get a job and keep it. But diamond tip number one is computers. Computers. These days, computers are everywhere, and you're going to find them in the job places. So you're going to need to learn them. Diamond tip. But they're so expensive, Todd, is what you would say to me if this wasn't a video, and instead, an expensive Skype conversation. And I would say, there's ways around that. And also, don't be so familiar with me. You don't know me. Diamond tip. You don't have to jump right in to become familiar with computers. Really, they're just robots without bodies. And robots are just imitation humans. So just have a friend pretend to be a computer for now. Computer, what are the lyrics to that song by Flo Rida? I don't know. Computer, load up an erotic website. Diamond tip. Getting the skills to survive in the job market is hard. You can't just get them from eating the hearts of your enemies like back in the 80s. You need to go to school, fool. Diamond tip. I've been operating a business slash massage school for months now called the Diamond Touch. It helps students compete in a competitive world of competition. Keep on calculating, Terry. While you're calculating, notice that I'm using my hands to massage your back. Make sure you divide that number by another number, Terry. Are you ready for another diamond, diamond tip? tip. No. Diamond tip. Recently, Finance Minister Jim Flaherty said that any job is a good job, which, while it sounds vaguely communist, makes sense. Employment numbers in this country aren't split into good jobs and <laughs> jobs and <laughs> jobs. They're just jobs, which means they are equal and good. I just wish everyone agreed. Diamond tip. My son TJ means the world to me. Last year, my wife, ex-wife, Karen, told a judge that my job at Taco Shack wasn't fulfilling my child support payments and that my hours made it impossible to see TJ. Those same hours made it hard for me to find a different job, and I kept hurting my body. So I started my school, but things haven't been going too well. And when the judge said to me, what kind of dad do you want to be? I said, any dad is a good dad. Diamond tip. Well, he agreed and gave Karen's new husband, Gary, custody of TJ. Oh. TJ, he doesn't even recognize me anymore. I'm sorry, could we, could we reshoot this? <laughs>